So our show today is all about the phrase, I won that. My next guest says that phrase means more to her now than ever before. So she entered Duck Brand's Stuck at Prom scholarship contest where students are challenged to create and wear their own prom outfits made entirely from duct tape. Well, 17-year-old Larissa Leone turned 47 rolls of duct tape <laughs> into a beautiful dress to pay homage to her Mexican roots. And she won the grand prize, $10,000 scholarship as a result. Please welcome a woman who won that, Larissa Leon. Come on out, Larissa. Pictures, pictures don't do it justice. No. It's beautiful and pictures is stunning. Can you turn around before you? This is beautiful. Oh my gosh! Can you sit down? Yes. Okay. <laughs> this is this is beautiful. Thank you. Okay, take me through. You, you heard about the contest. Yeah. A lot of students might write an essay. Mm -hmm. You're like, essay nothing. <laughs> I've got something for you, but what? How did you know you could even do this? So during like the 2010s, uh, duct tape was super popular. I was one of those kids who made wallets. So I found out about the duct tape scholarship. One day I was like, I'm gonna do that. So I did it and I applied and I won. Well, you did. <laughs> okay, but <laughs> Larissa, going from a wallet to this yeah. is a big jump. Yeah. Did you sew before? Did you have any kind yeah. of skill of that level? Yeah, during the beginning of a pandemic, I started sewing masks. And from masks, I did shirts and dresses. So I took on this project. <laughs> so yeah. this is incredible. You obviously are showing love to your heritage in this. When you were going through the sketchings, did you say, this is what I, I feel compelled mm -hmm. to give love to my, my people? Yes, I wanted to do something that's more than just a typical dress. I could have done a regular prom dress, but I wanted something that showcased a part of me, and that part is my heritage, that part is my Mexican yeah. heritage. Beautiful. When you told people that you were going to make this dress, out of duct tape and you're showing them the sketches where there are folks who and friends who said, there's no way. Yeah, some people were like, you're really gonna make that? And I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna try. <laughs> <laughs> How many hours total? It took over 160 hours. It took like a span of three months. Three months? Uh -huh. Were yeah. you doing it in your room? Were you like, what? Where do you have space to create a dress this big? In my, I started in my room, kind of got too big, moved on to the living room. <laughs> yeah, it was so a mess. You won the $10,000 to put towards your education. Mm -hmm. I'm sure for your family, that was also life-changing in some ways for them. Yeah, my parents were ecstatic. Um, we never thought we were gonna get this scholarship, so they're really happy I could get financial support anywhere I can get it. And your grandparents and family members all just yeah. had to be so proud. Mm -hmm. My grandparents always taught me to be really proud of my roots. So seeing that they, I represented my culture in this dress, they were ecstatic as well. When you finished the... <laughs> now, when you finished the dress before you sent it off or showed them the dress, did you look at that and say, that's a winner. I'm gonna win this thing. No, nobody can mess with this. <laughs> I did have high hopes. Um, oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> Listen, I don't know what the other competition, and I'm sure, kids, it was amazing. <laughs> but, oh, yeah. but you came to slay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I did have high hopes, but there was 10 other contestants that did amazing as well. Yeah. So I was hoping for the best. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, so next year you're headed off to your first year of college. Yes. Are you going to pursue clothing design, or what's the future? So I actually want to be a doctor, a dermatologist. Oh. I've, always been, yeah. <laughs> I've always been interested in the medical field because I've had really bad acne since I was young. So I'm pursuing that, but I do want to keep a fashion as a hobby and probably as a small business someday. <laughs> well, can you, will you dress me one day? Yes. Okay, I have to think about what I want. <laughs> And I, because I'm just, I'm enamored with this. And you've created other things. Yeah, I've also created accessories, as you can see. And I also created some earrings for you, oh. right there. Now they told me this box is mine. <laughs> Open it up. I, 
Did you know green is my favorite color? One of my favorite colors. Oh, this is so sweet. I'm gonna take them out. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Good luck in school. Well, first of all, look, it's luck and hard work. Yeah. And I know you're ready to put in the hard work. So <laughs> congratulations. I'm trying to put my earring on. Let's see what it looks like. Thank you, Larissa. Aww. Congratulations and my love to your family, your grandparents, and everybody at home. Good luck in school.